So we got our two. We're gonna add two of these tablets. We're gonna tap it, put our tablets in there. Yep. We're gonna shake this up for exactly four minutes and wait for this to dissolve. So after five minutes, this was the color. And if we compare this to the chart, it is the darkest, right? This looks really dark to you guys. Mm -hmm. So eight part per million is what Court Point has for dissolve. My name is Kiana. We're taking a sample for the pH from four point water. So we filled it up to the 10 milliliters. And now we're gonna put the pH tablet, the test tablet, whatever. And shake it. So, And it's the pH is eight. Hi, my name is Karen, and today I'll be testing the nitrate concentration in the four point channel. So the first step is to fill the test tube up to five milliliters of our sampled water. So once you filled it up to the five milliliter mark, we're gonna put one of these tablets in, cap it, now put it in the sleeve and shake for two minutes. So now you take the test tube out of the sleeve and you see what the water looks like. With this little chart, you can see that it's very light. So it's five parts per million.
I'm Aiden, and I'm gonna test the phosphate in the seawater in Boston. All right, so I filled it up to 10 milliliters. I'm gonna put a tab in, put a cap on it, and then leave it, shake it around a bit for five minutes so we can see the phosphate. Based on the color and the graph, it's about one ppm, maybe less, maybe even less. Here are the results. These look like zero Jackson turbidity units because you can see very clearly. So that means good, the water is healthy.